nation's capital in College Park, Maryland, the Xfinity Center. Filled to capacity for a Big Ten matchup of two upstart programs. One in the top 25, Indiana, the other hover. Protect your paint. Oh, they're missing buddies inside. Sticks unable to get that one to go. Maryland playing with some anxiety here at the outset. Over three minutes gone by. There's an answer from deep. Still an excellent start for the Hoosiers. They lead by 10. And this, with Tennessee out there, enables Romeo to roam a little bit more. Yeah. Maryland had in the second half of that game with Minnesota. They were getting anything that they wanted to Bruno in that game. And not beautiful scoop to the hoop, just making it look easy. And it's 25 to 14, a much needed three ball for the Terrapins. They have struggled from beyond the arc here at the outset, just two out of seven. There he is again. That is some maneuver. And he made it look so easy. I mean, at the other end, obviously, th 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 he does the job defensively. And on the offensive end, he takes his time, Romeo Langford. If there is a better finisher at the rim in America, not, not just a freshman, but anywhere, please tweet it to Timmy Brando. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a social media guy, but this kid, he, he just finishes. He's one of the best finishers I've seen in a Eight in the game for Eric Ayala. He and Anthony Cowan have carried the Terrapins. What point production they've gotten, it's come from their backcourt. Langford leaves it for Durham. He rattles it home. Defensively, as the game wears on, we'll see if that uh, is a continued theme here in the second. Beautiful slip to open, and the pass inside deflected by Ayala. It is saved by Devontae Green. Langford really needs to start thinking about taking over. And there's a reach-in foul. So how important going into that locker room is to, to kind of gather yourself. Maryland has really come out Sunday night at 10 o'clock Eastern time. His parents, Tim and Sabrina, have got to be so proud. This young man has a playground named after him in New Albany, Indiana. 19 years old. Man. 19. Special family, special kid. No doubt. They need him right now, too. They're going to cut into this lead. Look at that finish. That's just unreal. And again, the effortless nature. Mistakes will find you, and the ball will find you on occasion. Langford, a little stop and go. And he draws contact to the foul. Set a botched inbounds play in the Big Ten tournament cost them an opportunity to come further than yeah. it did a season ago. I think has inspired this club this season. Langford gets both. Langford on a blow by. Boy. He can finish, man. I mean, that, that... not just open lane. That's ATM action there. Wow. Only his fifth the season is second made. Wow. That made, yeah. that made yeah. Apple seem yeah. Fernando. <laughs> All night for Indiana. Can't use a lot of that clock though, Timmy. Gotta imagine Maryland will sit on it once they get the ball back a little bit. Yeah. And when Langford gets it, he needs to be selfish. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Cannot tell me, you know, his medical staff and coaches are like, eh. <laughs> And then you said it. Here's... What makes you say that? <laughs> <laughs> Screaming up and down the sideline. Yeah. Langford now, it, it, you know, with each got the ball, he's either going to get one when he's going to the basket. I think of the, the, the. I think he is now. I think. He could play any position on the floor yeah. at any level. Yeah. yeah. He's not yelling at me about the foul. I'm probably never mad at this player. Yeah. Especially this late in the game. Yes. That's a bump on this end against Cowan. Really a simple.
And it's critical to get those at home, isn't it? Especially when you're a team as young as Maryland is. The more comfortable you can be, first and foremost. Hoosiers need something quick. And the right guy's got the ball. For three. 25.9 remaining, and it's a four-point game. He was right in line with us with the basket, so we could see how those shoulders were just square, the little sidestep. Doesn't look like... <laughs> they still have to the inbound it, and they did. I wonder if Scott Van Pelt is going to be talking about that last bucket <laughs> later tonight of Maryland alone. That's our final for Donnie...